Welcome parents and good morning children. Welcome to standard 3 mathematics class. Today we are going to learn a new chapter data handling chapter 11 from your mathematics book. What is data children? A data is a collection of numbers to get information. Now what is data handling? Data handling means sorting of information collected in a systematic way. There are two ways to do it. One is pictograph and the other one is tally marks. Now we learn pictograph. So children, what is pictograph? Any information represented through picture is called pictograph. Pictograph gives us three important information. Title, data, and a key. So let us solve a sum on pictograph. Your sum is the number of girl students in each class of a middle school is depicted by pictograph. The key given to you is one smiley equal to four girls. This is the picture given to you. Based on this picture and the key, you have to solve these three questions. So, you have to be very careful in observing this picture. So, the first question is, which class has the minimum number of girl students? So, class 1 has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Is this the correct number? No, we have to multiply this with 4 and then we get the exact number of this class. So, 6 into 4, that means this has 24 girl students. Come to the next. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 into 4 again has 20 girl students. 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 into 4, 16 girl students in class 3. Class 4, 1, 2, 3. 3 into 4, that makes it to 12. Class 5, 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 into 4, again 16. Class 6, 1, 2, 3. 3 into 4, again makes it to 12. Now class 7, 1, 2. 2 into 4, 8. So which class has the minimum number of girl students children? Class 7. So we write... 7 here. You can also show the working 4 into 2 that makes it to 8. Now our second question. How many girls are there in class 1? So class 1, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 1 smiley equal to 4. So 6 into 4 that gives you 24. So how many girl students in class 1? 24. Is the number of girls in class 4 less than class 2? So for that you have to calculate class 4 and class 2 both. So class 4 has 1, 2, 3. That means 3 into 4 that is 12. And class 2 has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 into 4 that is 20. So the question is, is the number of girls in class 4 less than class 2? Class 2 has 20 and class 4 has 12. So your answer is yes. The second way to show data handling is through tally marks. What is tally mark? A tally mark is counting the object or information in group of 5. The mark I is called tally mark. While preparing a table using tally marks, 4 vertical lines crossed by a slanting line make a group of 5. Like 1, 2, 3, 4 vertical lines and the slanting lines makes it 
a group of five. Now here are a few numbers for which we will draw the tally marks. So three, as we know, four vertical lines and one slanting line makes a group of five for tally. So one, two, three, three lines for three. Then the next, no vertical line here until it reaches five. Again here. Four vertical lines. Now seven. So how many lines, children? One, two, three, four. And shall we draw one more vertical line here? No. This becomes the slanting line. So what is this? This is group of five. This represents five. Then five plus two more lines makes it. 7. Then the next one, next number is 10. So 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. Group of 5 again 1, 2, 3, 4 and again a group of 5. So 5 plus 5 makes it 10. Next number is 15. 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 here? No. So, the slanting line makes it group of 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, 5 plus 5 plus 5 makes it 15. Your next number is 19. So, 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. Then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 5 plus 5, 10. Now 9 left. So how do we write 9? Again 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then 1, 2, 3, 4. So 5 plus 5, 10. Plus 5, 15. 15 plus 1, 2, 3, 4 makes it 19. Now let us solve this sum through tally marks. Show the tally marks for the following table. Wickets taken by different bowlers during a year. This chart is given to you. The names of the bowlers are Ashwin, R. Jadeja, Ishan Sharma, Zahir Khan. These are the number of wickets, 18, 9, 13, 17. Now you have to show this number of wickets through tally marks. So 18 as I taught you, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Again, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5. So this makes it 5 plus 5, 10 plus 5, 15. And 15 plus 16, 17, 18. Now 9. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Did you understand children? Now 13. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 5 plus 5 makes it 10, 11, 12, 13. Now Zahir Khan, 17 wickets. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 5 plus 5, 10 plus 5, 15, 16, 17. So our tally marks is complete. And this is how you will show your tally marks. So children, today we learned pictograph and tally marks. 
the two methods to show data handling. Worksheets based on these will be uploaded on your school website. Please go through them and follow the instructions given. Thank you.